All right, so we're going to talk about emergency gear extension on the 182RG. It has something to do with this lever right down here. Please, for, uh, I'm going to slow it down a little bit. Thank you. So talk to me about what needs to be done, sir. Well, in a, in a real emergency, if you pull the handle out, uh, you would put it in gear down position first. Um, and we'll pull a gear pump to simulate a gear failure. So we put the handle down, there's no action. So now that the gear's down, the gear handle's down, we'll pull the handle forward. It'd be a little tricky to get it out and then pump to get the gear down. So we just pull straight out? Yep. There you yeah. go, and then start pumping. How many times do I pump? Oh, it was a lot. Ah! A lot. You gotta be patient with it. Not feeling any pressure, is that right? Uh, yep, I believe so. It'll get stiffer after a while. Oh, now it's starting to. Yeah. On 20. A lot of I pump. Get anything out of here? Nope. Yeah, it's coming down. Yep, you're about two thirds of the way. You look in the gear mirror. That's pointed straight down. You're about, you're getting close. 30. When our traffic here, this is left crosswind for runway five, departure to the west. So you got a green light now, that you got it locked. Down, all the way? Yep. And it gets pretty, res you get a lot of resistance when you pump. Yep. And you lock the handle oh. back in. There's the gear. There. That's how so it's the thing is, so you would pull the pump. Yep. You put the handle down, and you would pull this out straight that way. Yep. And then you would pump that. It took me about between 30 and 40 times, and you got almost no tension on it for the first 20. And it's been 20 to 30. It started going in from 30 to 40. It got really, really strong, and that's when the gear light came on. And I guess if the gear, if you had electrical failure, where the gear light didn't work. Because if you have electrical failure on this, is the gear going to come down? Uh, no. So, so it doesn't it's fall. It actually takes the pressure of the pump to make the gear come down. Correct. Whereas on the arrow, it just releases the pressure. All right, so if you had a total electrical failure, then you wouldn't have the light, but you would at least be able to visually see and see in your gear mirror out right. there. Right. All right. Well, that's pretty simple. And what speeds would you do that at? I noticed you slowed the airplane down before we put some flaps on. Well, uh... You can't tell what speed we slowed down to. Yeah. Well, we're 114 knots ground speed. Yeah, so. we're, we're well below 140, I can tell you that. That's the gear extension speed. Gear extension speed is what? 140. 140, okay. Indicated. All right. 